This is a plant I found in my neighborhood. At the bottom of the plant, there's obvious missing dirt because the dirt has moved away. This is an example of erosion. The dirt moved away from the plant because there's a sprinkler here, and the sprinkler, when it's on, rises and shoots the water pretty far. Since this plant is on a small hill, the water mixed with the dirt causes the dirt to move down slowly. It's happened to this plant, to this plant, and even to this plant. Here's another example of erosion in a different area. When the sprinkler shoots up, the dirt slowly moves down because it is elevated. Similar to the other example, you can see here at the base of these plants, the dirt is moved from the base and you see missing dirt. The water collects up at the bottom of the elevated area and you can see a water line moving from here to here. You can also see a lot of dirt missing around from the base of this tree and there's even more dirt missing around from these plants. Lastly, here's an example of chemical and physical weathering. The crack is not in a perfect line which indicates it is not man-made. This crack is most likely caused from the freezing and thawing of water from the sprinkler over here. The minerals of this rock breaking down could be caused from constant watering from the sprinkler and or rain. There are also examples of erosion here from the dirt missing at the plants and there is also a water line at the end of this area similar to the other example.